I've made an entire course teaching you everything you need to know about React. Here's an excerpt. Let's start talking about React. React is one of the most popular JavaScript libraries in the world. React was invented to streamline the development process as well as improve performance when building front-end applications. It does this by allowing users to create reusable parts called components. When a user interacts with a page and it updates, it only updates the components that change rather than updating the entire page. This results in better performance. A really important principle to keep in mind when using React is the single responsibility principle. As it relates to React, we should think in the mindset that each component should only have one job. If you start building a component and realize that it needs to do more than one thing, then you probably need to split what you're building into two or more components. The reason this is especially important in React is because of performance. React is known to be a great library to work with because it has the ability to let you build performant websites. In order to do this, however, you need to ensure that when an individual component updates or re-renders, it's only that component re-rendering, not multiple pieces that end up re-rendering due to side effects and due to being interdependent. By leveraging React, we'll really start to amplify our development speed and greatly expand the scope of the projects we can complete on our own. It's important to understand how data flows within React, however, because data in React flows one direction, right? So it flows from parent to child to child to child. It doesn't go from child to parent to parent to parent. The, the reason this is important is because of those props and state. So you can pass props from a parent component to a child component, but you cannot pass props to a parent component from a child component. If you'd like to get access to this tutorial and dozens of others that will take you from HTML all the way to interviewing for your first front end role, check out this link right here and I'll see you guys in the next one.